Well, it's a box, and the box is designed to make voting from home fun. It contains party materials, voting instructions, and the campaign is taking off. More than 2,000 people have signed up to get one. This is a get out the vote factory, an assembly line putting together party at the mailbox goodie boxes. Volunteers are preparing 2,000 of them to drum up excitement and to help people celebrate their civic duty. But to make them feel more empowered, to make them know, let them know that um, there's a safe way of voting and to realize that this is important no matter of what's going on in the world right now. We still all have a voice and we all still have power. Voters get one by registering online at baltimorevotes.org forward slash party at the mailbox. Your mailbox is your ballot box. The kit contains a t-shirt, snacks, posters, instructions on how to prepare your ballot and vote. We have the polling locations where you can still drop off your ballot. We have the directions for how you can mail in your ballot, making sure we remind you all about using black ink, making sure that you sign the oath on the other side of the ballot, and making sure that you know that you can also drop it off at any day or any time before June 2nd or by June 2nd. The Party at the Mailbox campaign is a partnership between Black Girls Vote and Baltimore Votes. Voting is so important because policy is tied to voting and people don't understand the importance of policy. Just look at your pocketbook, look at your wallet, um, look at your trash collection, uh, look at uh, the amount of taxes you pay for state, uh, look at your federal state taxes, um, look how fast you receive your unemployment in these times. All these things are a direct result of policy. The movement team is spending the Memorial Day holiday delivering these packages. This is the West Baltimore home of Shana McIver. Party at the mailbox. Hi. Here's your party at the mailbox delivery. Oh, thank you. I'm so excited. <laughs> Stay safe, but get out and vote. Thank you so much, Black Girls Vote and Baltimore's Vote. Thank you. If you want to turn your home into a festive polling place for one, we have a link with more information on the WBAL-TV app. Reporting live near City Hall, David Collins, WBAL-TV 11 News.